Hey everyone! In this video, I will show you how to connect Clearbit with HubSpot CRM with the help of Integromat. The purpose of this integration is to watch for new emails received in Gmail, then retrieve the sender's details in Clearbit, and if the person's sector matches a specified sector, let's say information technology, a new contact is created automatically in HubSpot without writing a single line of code. Let me show you. On Integromat, an integration is called a scenario, and this is the scenario builder. The first step is to click on the question mark and search for the Gmail app. Now you'll see the list of modules that are available. For this case, select the watch emails module. You need to add or select an existing connection. Choose a folder that you want to retrieve emails from and select the criteria. You can also choose where you'd like to start processing from. The next step is to click the plus sign here and search for the Clearbit app. The module to use here is the get a person or company. Now, all you need to do is map the email element output by the Gmail module to the email address field here. And finally, search for the HubSpot CRM app and select the create update a contact module. After adding or selecting a connection, map the relevant elements output by the Gmail and Clearbit modules to the fields. In this case, it's the company name from the Clearbit module, the email address from the Gmail module, and the first and last name also from the Clearbit module. Okay, now let's say you want to create or update a contact in HubSpot CRM that belongs to a specific sector only. Let's stick to the information technology example. To do this, you need to add a simple filter on the route between the Clearbit and HubSpot CRM modules. So click on the route and map the company category sector element in the top field and select the equal to text operator. In the bottom field, simply type in information technology. So it's time to execute the scenario. First, ensure that you have at least one unread email in your inbox. Now click run once and watch the magic happen. There you go. The scenario execution was successful. The email was retrieved from Gmail and the sender's details were retrieved and outputted by the Clearbit module. Since this person's sector is information technology, the filters criteria was met and the contact was created in HubSpot. Cool, right? But what happens if the sender does not exist on Clearbit? In this case, the module outputs a runtime error. However, in Takermat has tools to handle errors like this. All you need to do is add a filter on this route. Map the error type element outputted by the Clearbit module, select the equal to text operator, and type in runtime error in this field. Now the scenario is fully configured. If you click on the clock icon, you can choose how often you want this scenario to run at regular intervals, once, daily, and so on. By default, it's set to run every 15 minutes. And the last thing to do is to turn the scenario on by clicking the switch here, and you're good to go. And that concludes this video. Thanks for watching and happy automating.